Can you tell us about the relationship between Mike Pence and Donald Trump today? He seemed to throw uh, Mr. Pence under the bus last night. No, that's not true. In fact, Mike Pence is on other networks right now talking about what a fabulous job his his running mate, the top of the ticket, did in the debate last night. But over the Donald weekend, Trump. he was nowhere to be seen, Kellyanne. I know he's out there today, that's, but he was nowhere to be seen over the weekend. No, that's actually not true. Friday, he was active. Saturday, he decided not to go to Wisconsin. And if, if Donald Trump wasn't welcome there, then he wasn't welcome there. And then on Saturday night, it may not be public, but he flew to Rhode Island to keep a commitment at a fundraiser that was done for the Kelly joint committee in. between the RNC and the campaign. Yesterday, okay. he had a Sunday off after his debate. Do you right. expect that Speaker Ryan will keep his endorsement of Donald Trump, or will he defect as well? I don't know, Charlie. I certainly hope Speaker Ryan keeps his word and his endorsement of Donald Trump. Um, Speaker Ryan, of course, w took to the stage in Wisconsin at his event and faced some boos from the crowd because those who were expecting to see Donald Trump. But we're happy the Speaker of the House has endorsed, uh, has endorsed the nominee, Donald Trump. But what are these defections he, they, doing to the campaign? I mean, these are people who had endorsed Donald Trump, who were hopeful that he would be a different kind of candidate, and now they're disendorsing him. What does that do to the campaign? Well, it tells us that many of them don't want to support him, and we're going to take the case directly to their voters. I can tell you, okay. as the campaign manager, we certainly welcome them back, and we hope that they All saw right. on display last night somebody who's willing to take the case to Hillary Clinton. If those members can live with giving the next three or four Supreme Court justices over to Hillary Clinton, they should, they should think about that. Kellyanne, there's a story making the rounds on social media about what Melania Trump wore, a Gucci pussy bow silk crepe de chine blouse. Under the circumstances, do you think that's a good choice? I know nothing about her outfit except that she looked beautiful in yeah. it, um, as she always does. But I, I don't confer with, uh, confer well, with don't her. Don't miss a point that, a don't miss a point that I'm making. Speaking. Don't miss a point that right. I'm making. Yes, she looked beautiful and lovely. That wasn't the question. I just think under the circumstances, that seemed an unusual choice. But we thank you. Thank you very much for joining us today. Really thank appreciate you. it.